Like, I think, I think we're quite close to digital superintelligence. It may happen this year. Digital superintelligence defined as smarter than any human at anything. Is generative AI potentially an existential threat to the human species? I think that's what I've been saying, yes. It really is an existential threat. Some people say this is just science. You know, first it's going to come for the blue collar jobs, working in the factories, truck drivers, whatever. Then it will come for the kind of like the low skill white collar jobs. Imagine waking up tomorrow and your job is gone. Not outsourced, not automated in a factory, but quietly replaced by artificial intelligence. In just five years, over 300 million jobs may be exposed to AI automation globally, according to Goldman Sachs. In this film, we uncover which jobs will vanish, which will survive, and exactly what you must do to stay relevant. This isn't sci-fi anymore. It's already happening. And if you're not adapting, you're already behind. AI is not coming for your job. It's already here. In this segment, let's check some facts. Fact one, Goldman Sachs estimates that two thirds of all current jobs are exposed to some level of AI automation. Up to 300 million full-time jobs globally could be replaced. Fact two, the World Economic Forum predicts 85 million jobs displaced by end of 2025, mostly clerical, administrative, and data-related. Fact three, in the freelancing sector, platforms like Upwork saw up to 5% earnings drop for writers and designers post chat GPT. Let's see what Elon Musk has to say about artificial intelligence. Like, I, mean, I think we're quite close to digital superintelligence. It may happen this year. Digital superintelligence defined as smarter than any human at anything. Now, scariest part? Which jobs are most vulnerable? Let's break it down by profession. Category one, administrative and data jobs. AI can do in seconds what took hours. World Economic Forum ranks these jobs among the top three most endangered by 2027. Category two, customer support. AI chatbots now resolve over 80% of first level queries. McKinsey estimates companies cut support costs by 30% with AI. Category three, retail and cashiers, self-checkouts, AI inventory. McKinsey projects the US will lose over 1 million cashier jobs by 2030. Category four, transportation. Autonomous vehicles are coming. Millions of truck and delivery drivers may be displaced by 2035. Category five, software developer. Job displacement risk, medium high. 30 to 45% of coding tasks may be automated by 2030. McKinsey report, 38% of software dev time could be automated by 2030. Gartner report, 58% of software engineering leaders say, AI-assisted development will reduce headcount for junior roles. GitHub reports, Copilot users code 55% faster. Companies may hire fewer entry-level devs. Category 6. QA tester. Manual and automation. Job displacement risk? High. Up to 70% of manual QA tasks may vanish by 2027. IBM research shows 75% of regression, UI, and integration tests can be automated. WEF, Future of Jobs Report, 2023. Software testing ranks among top 10 declining roles by 2027. Manual QA is declining fast and eventually vanish. Automation QA must pivot to AI model testing, edge case design, or system level QA. Category 7, Finance Analyst. Job displacement risk, medium. 25 to 40% of tasks could be automated by 2030. Goldman Sachs predicts generative AI will expose 35% of finance jobs globally. McKinsey Global Institute says tasks like data gathering, spreadsheet modeling, and report generation are 60% automatable. Analysts doing pure number crunching and data entry are most at risk. Category 8. Mechanical Designer CAD Engineer Job Displacement Risk Low-Medium 
15 to 25 percent of design iterations and modeling tasks may be AI-led by 2030. Autodesk. Generative design tools can reduce design cycles by 50 to 70 percent. Repetitive modeling, simulation testing, and draft optimization may decline. These aren't theories. These are timelines. Now to the jobs AI can't replace. Or JI is useless in this areas. Category 1. Healthcare. Global demand for doctors, nurses, and caregivers is booming. McKinsey estimates healthcare will add 85 million new jobs globally by 2030. AI can assist with diagnostics, but not with empathy or complex care. Category 2. Skilled trades. Roles like electricians, carpenters, mechanics, and chefs are safe due to their unpredictable hands-on nature. McKinsey classifies these as low automation potential jobs, even by 2030. Today 3. Creative Strategy. AI can generate, but not originate. Strategy or deep emotional storytelling. Jobs like creative directors, high-level marketers, and brand strategists are growing when paired with AI. Category 4. Leadership and High Judgment. Senior roles that require negotiation, ethics, leadership, or decision-making under uncertainty are irreplaceable. AI lacks context, empathy, and accountability, all core to leadership roles. You don't need to beat AI. You need to learn to use it. For creatives, writers, designers, marketers. Master tools like ChatGPT, Midjourney, Canva AI, Copy.ai. Learn prompt engineering, the number one skill emerging on platforms like Coursera and LinkedIn Learning. For finance and analysts, learn Python, Excel AI integration, Power BI, ChatGPT, plus financial modeling. Understand how to validate AI-generated numbers. For skilled workers, embrace AI in diagnostics, e.g. smart meters, IoT. Upskill in tools like digital twins, AR-assisted maintenance. For healthcare, learn to interpret AI diagnostics, not fear them. Train in AI-integrated EMR systems, voice documentation, e.g. Nuance DAX. For students, focus on AI literacy, problem solving, data analysis, emotional intelligence. Learn to collaborate with AI through live use cases in schools. Final call to action. AI is not your enemy, it's a lever. Pull it right and it multiplies your value, pull it wrong and you're irrelevant. The jobs are changing, the skills are changing. The winners will be those who move first. So don't ask, will AI replace me? Ask, how can I become 10 times better with AI? Geo Polytech Hub. Signing off for this week. What are your thoughts? Please comment. And most important, like, share, and subscribe.